Well, Prince Harry is in Sydney to officially launch the countdown to the 2018 Invictus Games. The Invictus Games is an international sporting event for military veterans who have suffered an injury or illness. These are live pictures coming to us from Sydney with Prince Harry braving the wet weather, which he might be used to, <laughs> meeting the crowds at, crowds at Circular Quay in Sydney. Mark Reddy is there. Mark, can you take us through a little bit of the excitement that's going on Prince there? Harry, you're live on ABC. Live on ABC News. You need to keep that thing dry. <laughs> there we go. There we go. We got a few words from the Prince there. As you can see, it's absolutely jam-packed here. Uh, Royal Watch is trying to get as close as they can to the Prince. He, of course, is in Sydney this morning. We'll try and follow him here, but uh, he is in Sydney this morning. Uh, this weather is absolutely pouring. I think he's brought the bad weather from the UK with him. Of course, he's here to launch the Invictus Games in Sydney next year and uh, he spent the morning meeting with the Prime Minister and some of those athletes competing in Toronto. If we try and get closer to him... Yeah, Mark, uh, by all means, try and get closer. We can hear him through your mic in the background and a screaming fan, it seems. Yeah, that's right. Here we go. They're, as you can see, they brought tea and scones for the Prince. Uh, here we go. Uh, guys, uh, what have you got here for the Prince? We just tried to give Prince Harry a cup of tea to warm you off on this horrible day. He, he was interested but didn't, didn't try it out. <laughs> did, did he have any scones at all? Well, we, we didn't offer him scones because we couldn't get to it, but we got the tea and that was all. <laughs> and what is it about Prince Harry that's brought you guys down here today? Um, that he still comes out on days like this. Uh, here we go. Here are the scones, Kath. You can see there there's quite a variety uh, to choose from. Unfortunately, the prince didn't get to sample our scones down here. I'm sure they're just as good as the ones in the UK. Uh, and Mark, Mark, tell me, whilst the prince has moved somewhat away, he was with the Premier, New South Wales Premier Gladys Berejiklian there. What's he doing down in uh, Circular Quay with respect to the Invictus Games? Yeah, so at the moment, uh, some of those athletes, the 43 Australian athletes, are inside the overseas passenger terminal at the moment. And uh, he will meet them and have a look at how they've been training. They're going to compete in sports here this afternoon, including wheelchair basketball, seated volleyball and indoor rowing. And we're told that the Prince is also going to have a go as well. So we'll have to see whether or not he does. But as you can see, the atmosphere down here is absolutely fantastic, despite the bad weather. Weather. So many people have turned out. And I tell you what, if you weren't a Royal fan, you certainly would be now. We just saw someone pop a, uh, a sign up behind you saying, rain, hail, shine, all be mine. Yeah, um, look, there's all sorts of um, people down here. As you heard from earlier, Megan uh, Baisley, she's travelled uh, two and a half hours from Goulburn to be here and she claims to be the Australia. Uh, Megan, guys, do you have anything to say uh, to Prince Harry, live on ABC News here? Um, Why have you come down? Um, to see you. And what is it about Prince Harry that uh, brought you here? He's just a really nice guy and I love him. So there you go. There's some um, uh, other smaller fans here amongst the crowd, Kath. Um, as you can see, uh, they're all sort of heading over to the overseas terminal. Uh, after this engagement, that concludes Prince Harry's royal engagements here in Australia. And I'm sure he is staying at the Shangri-La Hotel, which is just to my left. And so I'm sure he'll have a fantastic view over Vivid uh, this evening. Indeed. Mark Reddy, thank you for braving the wet weather to bring us the latest on Prince Harry.